hello 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 welcome back to my channel and welcome to my channel if you are new here i am daquana white i bring you plus size fashion content as well as lifestyle and beauty content so today's video is actually going to be a shein try on haul fair warning a lot of these items may not be available one because items on shein already sell quickly but these items it's actually my fault <laughs> these were so like purchased so so long ago or sent to me really long ago but i do want to thank shein for sponsoring this haul i have two videos coming these will mostly focus on the fit of the items like i said because a lot of these may be out of stock but the quicker i can get these two hauls out i can bring you guys you know the current trends that are actively listed on shein so i was like you know but I'm still going to go ahead and do it. <laughs> We're still going to go ahead and get this content out. So with that being said, a little bit of housekeeping. I know you're going to ask. This is Yiddy, uh, the thong. And it's not the long line bra. It's the other one. And it's linked. If you click on my Hot 2 site, you'll see all of my links and all of that. So um, that's what this is. Hair. Uh, Y'all know Thrifty Slay actually is about to reopen. I'm super excited about it. I think I'm going to launch new products not on the reopening date but shortly after that uh everything that i try on will be linked down below the items will also be named and the sizes will be on the screen per usual and i think that's pretty much all the housekeeping you guys know i have changed the location so now you're gonna get kind of like consistent scenery when it comes to the content but other than that i don't think we have any more oh actually there is an announcement for the members of my YouTube channel. So if you are an active member of the YouTube channel, I still have your giveaway boxes going out. However, um, I have some new digital planners for the spring and summer. And then I have like a luxury. So we have three new sets, which is six in each set, spring, summer, and luxury. And um, yeah, I have some new digital planners launching and I'm going to drop a code or something in the members only tab on the community so you guys can go choose whatever planner you want. Just, you know, for us to thank you for being a member of my channel. I'm trying to get those perks out there more often. So with that being said, I'm going to give you guys that code shortly, probably the same day you see this video. Be sure to check the community tab. And if anything, I think I'm going to start like a group chat or something with you all in it because I feel like sometimes y'all forget or y'all don't really check the tab. Y'all just choose to support me, but I do want y'all to have perks. Nonetheless, let's go ahead and hop in again fair warning a lot of these items may not be in stock i'll try to find similar items but this haul is strictly talking about the sizing on Shein, and i'm gonna of course try on the pieces that i've had uh the shoes are definitely in stock but as far as the clothing you know it's fast fashion so things come and go really quickly oh my goodness the way this is eating right now so it's not that i didn't expect this from shein because shein really does have you know the really affordable cheap fashion um it may shrink in the dryer but this right here feels so high end so luxurious i didn't even know i had a button i love this Oh my goodness. So this is actually from the uh, Fit Plus collection. I'll have some curb items and some Fit Plus items. So this right here is a 24-26 for the blazer and I love it closed. What? <laughs> Y'all, this is eating right now. So um, 24-26 on the blazer and the bottoms are 24. I did not expect this piece to have stretch, but it does have ample stretch in it um, for it to be so heavy duty like this has some weight to it but it's still breathable and cool if that makes sense it is like a velvet material i'm gonna come up close so y'all can get the print the texture y'all they ate with this one the pockets oh my gosh this is probably and i love shein and i've had hundreds of pieces from shein but this is probably one of the best made items that i've had from Shein and that is no exaggeration. Uh, the pants also do have a pocket. The length on me, I know y'all really can't see my feet, but there we go. The length for me is perfect. I'm 5'4", my measurements are on my website. Click my hot two link, always in my description. But y'all, I can't, I can't stress enough how amazing this is. I really hope I could find something similar to link for you all because I, love this 
it's very rare that you even find on not just Shein, on any site, a blazer that closes effortlessly, a pantsuit that looks so good on. And y'all know I'm a collector of pantsuits. Um, the size is impeccable. Again, the bottoms are 24, top is a 24, 26. Impeccable, impeccable. I love the fit of this. My sincerest apologies for the fact that these items are eaten right now. And like, I really hope, again, I really hope I could find them or they bring them back in stock because I'm gonna link them regardless. Nonetheless, if y'all don't know, I do whatnot closet sales live streaming. So y'all can always come and find these items there. Not all of them, but some of them. I just don't keep everything. I don't have the capacity to. So um, yeah, y'all, this is really cute. Let's come and get the print. It's different. It's nothing like I have in my closet. I don't own anything. It's given like a ombre washed out denim type of feel. It's gorgeous. Now, this is the Shein Fit Plus collection as well. And it is a 26. It does feel more so like a 24. Like it feels like it runs a little small. Just in the thigh area. Like I feel like I can move my thighs and stuff. You don't really see too much of a crease. But I can literally like just, you know, feel that it's a little more snug in that area. This material does not have stretch. It actually is um, like just stretch in the waistband, but this doesn't have stretch, the actual material. Now you can button this up the way I had it, or I didn't take my bra off. I just like slid it all the way down and tried to tuck it. So yeah, these are naturally hanging boobies. Um, I like the bikini top with this. I like the fact that you can do a little off shoulder tease if you wanted to. Um, of course you wouldn't be able to see my bra if I just took it off, but yeah, y'all get the point. However, if you do do that, or you just want to take this off completely, be mindful that there is nothing covered in the back. Really? It's actually crooked on me. So yeah, don't do me, but it's a little crooked. It's just one strip. And it is elastic, so you don't have any control over, I guess, how tight it is around the waist or under boob area. Um, the only control you do have is with these strings, which you do tie yourself. So um, you can wear it, like I said, closed like this. And this is a cool material. It's definitely given transition from winter to spring. And I like that because it's cool. Still long sleeve. It's like good for days like today where it's 65 degrees. Um, it goes from 90 to 65 down here at NC. I don't know. But yeah, you can definitely play around with how you style this or how you wear it. So this is really cute. And it's given low key cruise vacation with this bikini top. And I know it's lopsided, like, I know. It should look something like that, I guess. But that is this three-piece set. Again, a 26, but it does feel like it runs a little small. And it may not. It may just be the fact that it doesn't have stretch. And I'm really used to a lot of things that I wear having stretch. So I know I said I have a separate Shein Fit Plus haul coming, but a lot of these items are also from the Fit Plus collection. I had already chosen them before I agreed to do the Fit Plus collection, like collaboration. So here we have, this is given like hot girl in the office because it's leather, faux leather, but then it's still like, it's something about leather that just speaks to me. And it's like, it's a little sexy, edgy, you know, it's real cute. So um, here first, I'll talk about the skirt, which is a 26. I do feel like I definitely could have gotten the 24 or even the 22, simply because it's so much room in it. The only thing is if I was to do that, of course, it would definitely be tighter here if I can drop it. Like, there we go. So it'll be a little tight there and it's like, eh, I kind of like the looser fit. It just depends on the outfit you're going for. And honestly, I'm about to be 29 in a month in like two weeks. And um, I just be saying I'm 30 at this point and I have no problem with that. I don't, I'm not scared of my 30s or anything like that. I'm actually really excited because I feel like the 20s are so like for growth, for learning. And the 30s are just where you flourish. Like with that being said, the style is ever evolving. So this to me is it's giving. It's like, yeah, 
I can do this. Like, do I still like mini skirts, tight skirts, all of that? I do, but I can also appreciate <laughs> this, okay? So the split or the slit is really nice. I like that it's not in the dead center, but if you wanted to, you can definitely turn it a little bit more, um, but it does have like a rouged or a scrunched up waistband, so you'll start to see that if you turn it too much. Now, um, with that being said, again, this is a 26. I do feel like I could have sized down just a little bit, so I was looking in the back. The length is actually nice, and that's why I said it's given, you know, edgy work girl. Now this, I don't know if it's a top or a jacket. I know it's a 24, 26. And it is functional as far as like buttoning it up. Buttoning it up. So you can do those last two. And they have sturdy buttons too. And this is the full length of this top. And I definitely like it more tucked in. This is not my vibe. I would either wear it open or tucked into the skirt or a pant. And I do see some cream accessories just to bring out that faux fur cuff and pocket detail. So my bra is doing whatever it wants to do and I just don't got time for that. All right, here we go. <laughs> so yeah, this is how it looks open. I do feel like you could wear it tucked in or open and that would be my preference when it comes to this piece. And it does feel a little oversized, but it may actually be <laughs> intended to be oversized. So. That's why I'm just, I'm not complaining about it being a 24, 26. I'm actually thankful that it buttons comfortably. It's not buckling and I can appreciate that. She Girl. <laughs> okay, so let's just, let's just start from the bottom to the top. So the bottom, the shoes are Shein, of course. These are, I think it's like the Cuckoo or Cacao collection. I don't really know how to pronounce it, but their boots and their shoes are like some of my favorites. Actually, I have a white pair that looks just like this, but it's a slide with a gold chain. I had a black pair slide with a gold chain. These are so effortlessly cute. I love these. And this is comfortable for me. Like, I can walk in these booties and be comfortable. As far as support, the heel feels supportive, but the actual is a stretch boot. So it's not that much like constriction or restriction so you're getting comfort with the stretchy part but as far as if you're going to be walking up a hill a mountain girl these ain't the boots for you they're not for me anyways but they are a comfortable boot like if you're a girl who likes to shop and just casually wear heels this would be a no-brainer for you it'll be super easy and i just love that gold chain detail and i love the pointed toe so that's those shoes then we're going to get into the pant so these pants are actually um, 26. At first I was like, oh, I could have got the 24. But if I would have got the 24, they would have been like falling down. I feel like in the waist area, um, they do feel good on. They're not too tight in the thigh area. So I do like these pants in a 26. They have like a front slit. They're not long. Like they don't even reach my ankle or they're just touching the ankle. So it's definitely something where I do have to pay attention to the shoes. And sometimes I just don't like that. I like a longer pant so I won't have to pay attention. But I was expecting that with this pant because it has a slit in the front anyway. So the shoes will be important as far as this goes. But I am a girl who just likes to wear a wide leg, really long pant. So you really don't see my shoe. Um, and then this here, I actually ordered this on my own because I think they had burgundy and they had this green color and I was like oh no <laughs> oh no I need that ASAP and I had saw it after they had sent these orders to me so I was like no I'm gonna buy it like girl this is like a velvet ribbed material it has this fur on it and um absolutely it's given the sexy Grinch it's giving I don't know but it doesn't have pockets though if I'm not mistaken yeah, it doesn't have pockets, so keep that in mind. But I just love this. I love the color. I love the textures. I love the length of it. I love this so, so much. So yeah, I had to go get it. And I just saved it and didn't even wear it this past winter because I was like, I'm just going to haul it. I want to show you all before I wear it. So that is this outfit here. Okay, so let's start with the jeans first. I got these in a 28. Now, the jeans don't really feel like a 28. They feel like maybe a 26, 
but like a tour 26 where it's like is this really a 26 tour or is it a 22 because the legs are given 22 24 then the waist is given 28 30 and just hella roomy so it's not sticking to me in the parts where i need it to when i leave them alone they look fine but i know just walking around i'm probably gonna be like you know i gotta keep tugging at them i feel like they're falling i feel uncomfortable um the distressing i will say is done pretty nicely the length for me is really nice um again my measurements and my height and all of that five four um my measurements are on my site click the hop to link you can type in measurements or go to dwl which is my like blog for fashion so with that being said let's get into i will say with these being a 28 supposedly they don't feel like a 28 throughout the whole jean i feel like a 24 would have been nice for this area for me but the legs wouldn't have got in there um if that makes sense <clears throat> so much dust and particles flying around here so or lint rather then we have this like suede fringe i guess jacket it's so cute i got it in the 22 it may have been the only size available or i just didn't want it to be super duper oversized i don't hate it in a 22 i will say um the cuff of it like the wrist part is not really, you know, covering the whole arm. So it feels a little young, you know, but uh, I would have liked it in a 24. I feel like that would have been like the comfortable, good, like perfect size for me. Um, it is stretchy, so I didn't have a problem with the arm area. And I do like the fringe. I think it's a cute little, you know, jacket. Uh, cowboy boots or a pair of booties or over the knee boots would be really, really nice with this one here. This is how it looks in the back. For the jeans, they kind of feel like they're sliding down. Give y'all, I can move the fringe. <laughs> so it's given like, you can see, you know, my brief or garment underneath. So yeah, it has a dip. It's just, they don't seem like they were made right when it comes to the tummy area, when it comes to the jeans. So that is this fit here. Oh baby, oh baby. So this vest is giving. Giving the girls what it needs to give. It's the Shein Curve 4X, okay. Puffer vest, nice length. It does have a zipper. But can we get into this? No, I was not putting the other one on. Baby, this inch, like this feel like, these inches feel like a, a 12 inch. Like I'm standing in a ruler. And it's probably only about five. But it's a wedge. So I thought it would be better than the other heels that I tried like two weeks ago. Baby, no no <laughs> um yeah so and then they zip on the outside and as you can see i couldn't even zip them up i couldn't even zip them up so color fire you know it's one of those i forget what you call the boots but has that overlay and you could just see the point in the front it it tried it tried you know it, it, it gave not for me not for me all right if i even try to oh my goodness oh my god Y'all know I'm not a heel girl. I thought a wedge would work. It didn't. Nonetheless, um, this is a really cute boot. <laughs> a, a really cute boot. Uh, and as you can see, if you just fold this under, it's a wedge. It's a wedge. But it, if you're not a heel girl, baby, this ain't for you. And I'm not a heel girl. And I'm not scared to tell you guys that. Um, I slay without the heels. And that's okay. I, I have my little baby heels. And that's what we do. So that is this boot here. She's gorgeous. She's a great, a great piece for me to put on display. Not on my foot. I can deal with this. I can do this. All right. So this vest is a 4X and it is from the Curve Collection. Um, you know, you can zip it and all of that. I feel like it definitely gets shorter when you do go to zip it. But it is, you know, a functional zipper. I feel like this one is a little more cropped. Well, it is a little more cropped than the pink one. I still like both. Um, I mean, for these, I'm probably gonna have to wait till like fall and winter to wear them because, like I said, I wanted to wait to haul them for you all, and I didn't want to just start wearing it and then forget to haul it. It was a lot, so I didn't get to wear it yet, and it's fine. These are timeless pieces. Now let's get into the cargo. Perfect for the spring and summer. Um, I do feel like I don't really know if I like the fit, and I think it's the length for me. Like, I really just wish it was a tad bit longer. It's feeling a little short. They say cargoes are in. 
all right and it's always been hard for me as a plus size woman to find a good cargo pant which is why i tell you guys about the line of demarcation on the back of my thighs because i had a good pair of cargo pants that i wore in high school we had to wear uniform and i wore them all the time but they were too tight in that thigh area so that is actually where that line of demarcation came from two small pants but they were my favorite and yeah so anyways um i like the color i just wish it was a little longer and the fit come on now these are supposed to be a 30. these fit like a 22 24 like it's not i don't even give it a solid 24 but it's not giving 30. it's not giving the girls 30. i don't know why they lying to us but you know again i commend them for trying but I feel like it's a little misleading sometimes when we're calling something a 30 and it really fits like a 24, maybe a 26. Like I shouldn't have to be or I shouldn't be a 24 shopping the Shein Fit Plus collection and getting a 30 and it fits like a 24. It is just like y'all just want to say y'all have a US 30, but y'all really don't. But I also don't think they're really designing for the girls who have ass, hips and thighs. So that's that um this is how it looks in the back okay i like the looser fit i do feel like i would probably wear these with like a i don't even know what shoe i would wear just because i don't really like the length of them but nonetheless a cute like ivory cargo pant and yeah it doesn't feel like a 30 but you know that's what they call it okay all right this is a better cargo for me personally and it's actually because of the waist tie so let's just get into the jeans since I'm talking about them already. Um, these are also supposed to be like a 28 or a 30. I think it's a 30. And like I said before, I feel like they're just taking a number and slapping it on there and saying, here, this is for the fat girls and we're calling it a 30. So I don't like that aspect of it, but I will say it's true in nature. They have stayed true to themselves to the point where regardless of if you're smaller or larger sometimes when it comes to Shein, you do have to size up. You just do. And I don't know if it's because it's because of where they are made, like where they make the items, what they're used to, whatever the case may be. Or it could also be, you know, in the United States, we're not gonna lie and act like the people here, and it may be other countries too, but the people here do tend to be larger. And if we're talking about we wanna specify it down to black women, we tend to have assets okay so they're not again designing specifically with us in mind but i do feel like when they do their collaborations with black women that that should be a thing you know i still sh i shouldn't have to size up if it's a black woman collaboration with or a black man collaboration with Shein. okay so with that being said y'all know they need me they need me on the design board they need me up there on the table at the table but with that being said these are supposed to be a 30 they fit like a 24 26 um they have like if i pull them up enough they have like a crinkly feel which reminds me of like an older jean where like my parent would try to put me in when i was younger and i really didn't want to wear the clothes from lane bryant ashley stewart and all of that when i was like 15 14 13 but with that being said i still really like these i like the shade i like the little i forget what you call it it's not acid wash so i love the side pockets the top pockets it doesn't have pockets on the butt but i do actually really like the frayed hem as well now with these i couldn't wear the panty that i do have on because it's a high cut thong so i just kind of tucked them so my butt look crazy right now because it's like indenting right here with the thong but I do like how high these come up. I would just not be able to wear these with this specific panty. So that is this pair of pants. I like them, but of course, had to size up on them. Here we have this top. And this is just a really chill, comfortable kind of cropped sweater. I really like it. Now, I actually tucked it under my bra because I feel like it gave it a little more character when I did it that way. I didn't even get to show you in the back. I feel like my booty crack about to start showing. But it does have like a little twisty up, you know, type of back detailing and then like a little triangular cutout. So with it untucked, I really didn't like it. It really didn't give me what i needed or what i wanted 
but this is how it looked untucked and i actually do really like this color and it's something that you can put in your closet and just hold on to it till the fall because i feel like it's perfect for the fall season but that is this outfit here now this jacket actually matches my activewear collection that i released last year um, so I'm really excited about it. I'm not going to hold you to wear what well, I was excited <laughs> to wear with those pieces, but because of the arms, I'm probably not. Now, before we get into the dresses, this is the last trouser that I have. These pants are okay. Like I really want to keep them because I don't really have cargos that fit for real, but, um, well, it's really hard for me to get my hands on cargos. Let me say that, that actually fit. So I'm just like, eh, I'm not really sure. They fit like the ivory pair and it's just not, it's not doing it for me. Like, I don't feel like it does anything for me. Um, I feel like I can style it, yeah, but I don't know. I want it to already fit well before I actually style it. And then the length for me, it, you probably think it's okay, but um, I just want it like a little bit longer because of the shoes I would wear, I would want it to sit on top. And again, I have on a thong and you guys will probably see it um, when I pull this up. But yeah, I feel like I would definitely need to wear a belt. It's not doing nothing for the butt. It fits like a 24 in the leg area, but in this like waist area, it's just, it's just not doing it for the stomach and the waist. So that is this cargo. Okay. This one I really love. It's so like, I can't explain the comfort level in this dress. I feel like a tight and an over the knee boot will look so good, like a sheer tight. And an over the knee boot will look so, so good with this. And belted, it would be amazing. I even like it not belted where it's like effortless. And you don't have to worry. Most likely probably pick this out for the job um, where you guys will be getting a why I quit story or just like a get ready with me where I talk about quitting. It wasn't even like a specific reason outside of, I really had to just fully get back to what I love and what I'm passionate about. So, um, and what I went for, it wasn't even really benefiting me in that way, but I did gain some things from working. Okay. So with that being said, I probably got this for that, um, for like the winter or transition period to the spring. And I was going to wear it with the boot. And um, I feel like you can dress this up or down. It is a turtleneck and it's really, really chunky up here, but it's not uncomfortable. And I don't feel like it's going to wipe all my makeup off of my chin. So I could really appreciate that. It's a very, very lightweight. This is a 2426 from the Fit Plus collection. And the funny part is I actually got this for the actual Fit Plus haul as well. So you're going to see this piece in both hauls. But that's a good thing because I love this and I really hope that they have it because yes, please. Of course, if you belt it, it gets shorter. Okay. And if you just let it swing, it's cool. You know, it's real cool. Um, and this is the length of it in the back. I feel like it's just one of those effortless -da 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 type of pieces. Like, I don't have to worry about anything. I'm going to put this on, put on a nice shoe and I'm going to feel put together. Okay, this is the girls who's going to get the pumpkin spice lattes and all of that. This is their fall dress. This is this is that dress, okay? And maybe in a brown color too. But I would love this in an ivory color. But again, it's very, very lightweight for it to be like this sweater or knit material. It's very, very light and airy. So I can appreciate that. But that is this dress here. You'll see it again because I'm about to record the other Shein haul as well. Ooh. This make you hit a note, baby, because this is really cute, actually. Um, I got this most likely with work in mind. I would have wore a cami underneath a tight and a heel or like a mule or something because this is a little short for work, but it's not like, you know, it's not too, too short. It's just at the knee, okay? But I really like this and it feels very <laughs> sophisticated and absolutely i need this in my closet now this is like a crepey stretch material i don't know if it'll pick up on camera but this is the material it's giving okay love the gold buttons i think i'm definitely like a gold jewelry girl but at this year or the end of last year i've really been in that silver bag as well so um i do like the gold buttons though because i actually feel like this will look really nice with that gold chain booty 
in a tight as well so i wish this had pockets i got this in a 24 26 i do feel like this one is actually true to size it is a stretchy material but it's a comfortable stretch and it doesn't feel like it's stretching on all the wrong parts or anything like that and these buttons are functional well not this side but these side or well, this side is functional these buttons over here and it it works it doesn't feel like it's buckling or pulling or anything like that so she definitely does certain items right certain materials right so this is how the back is looking and like i said it's a little low cut so if i was wearing this to like just me going to my office you know i'll be fine with it but if i'm going to an actual meeting with other people professional setting whatever whatever i would definitely put like a cami on or you know just have my bra regular um i don't know because i don't want it to look like a bra but it doesn't look too bad so yeah that is this dress here baby if you wasn't thinking if you wasn't really looking for real you'd be like that bitch ain't got nothing on that girl ain't got nothing on okay so this is actually like i don't know if you can actually separate the layers okay so you can see this is like a nude lined dress and it makes you look nude it's given that wet dress sexy car wash dress lingerie-esque type of dress and i actually like it i didn't know how i would feel about it but i like it i think it's a cute sexy piece to keep for like a girl's night a date night i like the chocolate color i feel like a yellow accessory would look really really cute with this i like it more than i thought i would the only part that's actually mess and sheer mesh and sheer is the arm and again it's a nice transition because you really can't tell from arm to tit that it changes material so i like that um the only thing i will say is when it comes to these like off the shoulder dresses and the off the shoulder part just always don't like and they don't really ever want to cooperate so yeah that's that but the booty part the booty got a little squ oh girl i look naked i don't even know if it is centered oh my gosh i look nude but the way it scrunches around the butt, it really makes you look like you ain't got nothing on. Like, I'm like, is this, what is this? Is this Adam and Eve, Fenty? What is this? This is she in. I don't know. I really like it. And it's 24, 26. And I want to say it's from the Fit Plus collection because usually if it's the Curve collection, it's just like a 4X. So, yeah, absolutely. The only thing with me is I want these rouges, these ruffles to be right, you know, I don't want it to be like mad like that. No, no, I don't like that. I need it to be like that. So that's my thing here. That is this dress. I have one more dress for y'all. Okay, so I purposely got this in a 22 because I really wanted it to be fitted. And I have tried the Shein Fit Plus dresses before, especially like this ribbed or knitted material and they tend to run like really big. So I was like, let me get the 22 and not the 24 or 26 because I wanted it to be really snug. Now this is cute. I just feel like I want it to be way more snug on the bottom part i want it to look like you know like just hug the body but um i think a 20 would have probably did a little bit too much and i probably would have been uncomfortable and i probably wouldn't have gotten that you know snatch feel like i wanted anyway because it probably would have just been tight up here and not down there i don't know but i do like the color blocking i like the little swirly feel to it i think of course if you go with orange and blue accessories that would be really really nice or if you introduce another color like maybe a yellow or a hot pink but i don't know maybe a green i feel like that would be kind of cool too just to play with color because i do feel like you know with our fashion we kind of be really matchy matchy and um, we don't really play too much or experiment too much with our fashion these days and when i do see individuals and creators who do experiment with fashion and colors and patterns i love it i love it this is how it's looking back here it is solid so yeah that is this dress is definitely work appropriate um oh speaking of that so yeah i just have like this pointed toe flat which is really cute and really comfortable also the cuckoo or cacao collection i like the little extra detail of this band here it is a stretch shoe um something i probably would have wore to work to be honest uh 
not even gonna hold y'all because i wasn't gonna put on a heel but that is this dress and that shoe so you guys have seen all the shoes and all the items i thank y'all so much for joining as far as the fit i hope i was able to explain some things the moral of the story is size up but that's with the curve in the fit plus collection i do feel like i would want the fit plus collection to be more true to size but i also have to keep in mind who's creating the fashion and um you know i feel like sometimes if we want certain things we do have to do it ourselves and um for me i would just say you know keep a lookout okay but with that being said i hope y'all enjoy because this is actually one of the best Shein hauls that i've done when it comes to quality and how the clothes were made i feel like these are some really hot pieces i'm not gonna hold y'all those first two sets stole my heart <laughs> just stole my heart like i'm living for them so i hope y'all enjoyed this haul i will link everything down below and i do want to say sorry in advance for the fact that a lot of these will be sold out but i have to get this content out so i can bring you the more up-to-date and relevant pieces Change.